Today on Forbes, how Victoria's secret billionaire owner accidentally scored an $800 million stake in an AI unicorn. Lex Wexner, the Victoria's secret billionaire who stepped down from his company L Brands in 2020 amid scrutiny over his ties to convicted sex offender Jeffrey Epstein, is cashing in on the AI surge. Thanks to a $1 million seed investment in Atlantic Crypto, a little-known company that would become AI cloud juggernaut CoreWeave, the 86-year-old's family trust now holds a $720 million stake in one of the most valuable AI startups around. The Ohio-based billionaire is one of America's wealthiest people, worth an estimated $6.3 billion. Wexner's massive stake in the $19 billion startup was revealed in a lawsuit filed in the United States District Court in the Southern District of New York in May 2024 by wealth management firm Florence Capital Advisors. The New York-based money manager claims it was entitled to a $6.9 million fee for advising Wexner's family trust to invest in the startup in 2019. CoreWeave provides access to highly coveted chips used in building AI models. The company is among the most valued AI startups to emerge from the mainstreaming of artificial intelligence. It raised $7.5 billion in debt from Blackstone in May and $1.1 billion in equity earlier this year to build out a massive data center network that delivers the computing power needed to train AI. But back in 2019, it was a struggling cryptocurrency miner that had just started subletting its graphic chips to AI startups from a New Jersey garage. CoreWeave raised $1.2 million in a seed round in March 2019, according to PitchBook data. Wexner's money manager, Greg Hirsch of Florence Capital, invested $1 million then. He later picked up another $600,000 in stock from the company's Series A round and doubled down again through an additional convertible note. All of this was placed in a trust established for the benefit of Wexner's four children, Sarah, Hannah, David, and Harry. Fast forward to 2024. Now, those investments have evolved into a $720 million stake in the AI startup that's rumored to be seeking an initial public offering next year. And it's evolved into a legal squabble over what appears to be an accidental jackpot. The spat is a rat's nest of New York finance backstabbing, involving a father-son duo brought in to manage Wexner's money after Jeffrey Epstein allegedly stole $46 million from his family's trusts. It also involves a separate $100 million stake in CoreWeave made by a bankrupt hedge fund, allegations of double dipping, and the mysterious disappearance of files containing records on the billionaire's finances. Florence Capital denies all this and insists it is owed a fee for investment advice that generated, quote, an almost unimaginable 30,986% return when Wexner sold $71 million of CoreWeave stock in November 2023. That sale, combined with Wexner's estimated remaining stake in CoreWeave, makes the total windfall from the investment just under $800 million. Wexner's CoreWeave investment coincided with a bet on data centers that increasingly undergird the AI wave. Since 2019, he sold over $450 million of land around his home in New Albany, Ohio, and in neighboring Licking County, to tech giants like Google, Meta, and Facebook, and Wall Street powerhouses like Blackstone, that have used it to build massive data centers. With more than $15 billion in planned data center investments announced for Franklin and Licking counties in the past year alone, according to the Washington, D.C.-based corporate subsidy tracking watchdog Good Jobs First, Wexner is well-positioned for similar deals in the future. Through his real estate development firm, the New Albany Company, he still owns some $850 million worth of farmland in the area. This, according to Forbes' estimates. For full coverage, check out Ian Martin and Jemima McAvoy's piece on Forbes.com. This is Kieran Meadows from Forbes. Thanks for tuning in.